I ain't no psycho man. Your disease, and I'm the cure. It started with Rocky and continued with Rambo. And now comes Cobra, the latest bigger-than-life hero to be created by screenwriter and star Sylvester Stallone. Marion Cobretti, a.k.a. Cobra, he is uh, kind of like what I call the bottom line in police enforcement. You might say he's a modern-day gunslinger. Question is, Cobretti, did you use unnecessary deadly force? I used everything I had. Action door! Quickly, quickly, quickly! George Cosmatos, director of Rambo, reunited with Stallone to direct Cobra. We're trying to make it as stylistic as possible because then you can use your fantasy and your imagination, use the location to the best of your knowledge to make it work. Starring opposite Stallone is Bridget Nielsen. The 22-year-old Danish actress plays a model whose life is in jeopardy. For this sequence, Bridget, formerly a top European model, worked with costumer Tom Bronson to capture the look and energy of a real photo layout. And worked a lot of times for Italian designers. I know a little bit about clothes. I know my own body very well because I've been modeling clothes for five years. And we found some nice things. Leave me alone! <laughs> Stallone wrote the screenplay for Cobra. Like Rocky and Rambo, Stallone put a lot of himself into Cobra. I have a great deal of uh, sympathy for people that have been victimized. The perpetrators seem to just go free. The jungle has been totally reclaimed, you might say, by the animals. Do you think you would recognize me if you saw him again? The tall one? Yeah. The one that wants to kill you. I try to keep it gut level. I try to reduce the dialogue and intensify the action because I believe your actions are really your calling card. They do speak louder than any words I'll ever say. The hardest part in doing a film like this is not to become too preachy with it. I let people kind of like decipher what they want from the film. I think that you cannot lay out a 10 course meal. I think you've got to lay out a buffet and let people take what they want. There's all these crazy people everywhere. Why can't the police just put them away and keep them away? I tell them to the judge. What do you mean? We put them away, they let them out. Action! Bridget Nielsen began her acting career with the title role in Red Sonia, which brought her to America. Stallone cast her in Rocky IV, and she turned in a knockout performance. It's easy. I think it's easy to work with Sylvester. So we'll talk back and forth, and he'll ask me, do you think this is a good idea? And I say, oh, yeah. And so this is my opinion. Maybe this should change here and there. And then he'll look at it, and then he'll decide whether he agrees to it or not. But of course, yes, we, we discuss it. When Cobra and Ingrid are assaulted by a band of killers, a team of Hollywood's best perform daredevil stunts, exciting special effects, expert weaponry, and state-of-the-art camera work. It's a team effort, you know. We're not here on an ego trip. We're here to make a movie. And I think this works because we have respect for each other's work. Terry! Terry! Go. Stunt coordinator Terry Leonard planned a catalog of breathtaking stunts for Cobra. And we've got a, a broad spectrum of all stunt where we have fire suit gags, we've got motorcycles, we've got car chases, we've got fist fights, we've had a high fall. So we hit almost all the high points of motion picture stunt work in this film. For the exciting final confrontation, a working foundry was converted to a movie studio at night. It works 
every day. So we had to go in the evenings, like now. We're doing a day scene at night. So we put lights and stuff and smoke, and we do our own effects to the whole foundry. It's uh, difficult because you, you don't only have to work with two actors fighting, you also have to work with the environment, using the environment, using the fires, using the effects, and putting them all at the same time together. Well, I would say total time on planning a fight like this is about three days. You get a broad idea, and then you fine tune it. You keep fine tuning it down to the actual moves that you're going to make. Boom! 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 And then throw them right up on the hook. This is an actual foundry, and it, it runs into thousands of degrees. So this could cause you a great deal of harm if you were to bump against some of this machinery. So you have to play that as part of the fight. You have to be very aware that you could fall into that molten pit. But it makes for an exciting evening. Action! I think Sly is incredible. He just works right into the routine so well, it's like he's another stuntman. I've only worked with one other actor that is as good in the art of motion picture fighting, and that's John Wayne. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, look cool. yeah. That's getting yeah. down. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So I would just say that for the last three. I mean. You should love the movie you're doing. You should do it with the heart, not technical. And when you have heart in your movie, it affects others, other hearts, the hearts of the public. For me, acting is, is a much more internal, emotional affair. It's the ultimate level of excitement in my profession. This is what makes it all worthwhile. Cobra is an electrifying action thriller starring Sylvester Stallone as the strong arm of the law.